Welcome guys, welcome back to another episode of GTA LSPDFR Patrol. It's another day, another patrol. They will be doing some K9 patrol in the city of Los Santos. Hope you guys enjoying the series so far. Thank you guys for all the support on the last episode yesterday. If you guys want to see more, feel free to drop a like, hit that subscribe button. And don't forget to smash that bell so you get notified when I release videos on the channel. Alright, let's go. We're joined today by our little canine friend Rex across there. But you can clearly see he's next to me. Okay, what's going on? A couple of must bombs on someone up there. Yeah, so I, I'm using the um ultimate backup canine partner instead of the actual separate mod it's some controls issues there Rexine car Yes, swing up here. Dispatch one Lincoln eighteen, show me available. Negative dispatch. Wow. This part show me available. For real? For real? For real? <laughs> wow. That's weird. This part show me available. Finally. <laughs> Uh, the one time that this watch decides not to hear me. And the balloon just turned off the lights. I was wondering what went on there. So far, so good. Nothing. Nothing really is going on right now.
in next episode I'll I'll see if I can get a new vehicle park next episode some mix ups so I bet I'll get a new vehicle park next episode we'll be doing a bit more some more um, K9 patrol next episode also with the new vehicle park I just made a whole loop around to the um back to the station. Hopefully we got someone with narcotics or something. And the light was on green? Ha! <laughs> I didn't even see the light was on green. Wow. Silly me. Hmm. Just got a tag on one of these vehicles here. Yeah. Sorry, if you go. I let him follow me. I'm gonna pull over right. Right here. Dispatch one Lincoln eighteen, show me on a stop. Something suspicious is going on here. The driver is swerving, sweating nervously. Dispatch we got requesting a play check. Yeah, I know dispatch I don't understand what I said there. It was really confusing to me and all. Dispatch requesting a play check. Three citations. Alright. 
Let's see, she has three citations. Parking on a bridge, okay. Speeding. Well, obviously, they, she has a sports car. So definitely, she had to have one for speeding. But that's a very low speed. Failure to the. Yeah, okay. Not no major um, citations. But why is she nervous? Okay, I don't mind if you don't answer. You're just very nervous. I'll take a breath of at us because you're really nervous and sweating. Okay. Um, sir, seriously? 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 Seriously. <laughs> yeah, I just felt like a few minutes I said seriously to that guy. Uh so let's figure out what's Oh the vehicle. Okay, so she's definitely not intoxicated. She can snap to shoot, so that's one sign. Follow me here. Yeah. Let me just search your vehicle. Over there. Tracks out of the car. If you had only man, man, seriously. had a reason why she was nervous and the canine sniffed it out good job Rex where Rex I can have what the frick Pressure on what and I meant to put Rex in the car. Rex. So she got the dog sensed. Dog smells something. 
Let's see what it is. A silencer, seriously. What are you doing with a silencer? No wonder she was nervous. She has a silencer in her car. Ooh, is she trying to assassinate? And in the driver's side too. What would be really weird is if I find a gun or not. I would definitely know she was trying to assassinate someone. binoculars that's okay but then if you put that together with what the, the other two things she has that's kind of suspicious should I charge her for possession of a weapon because technically a silencer can easily easily get a weapon on Let's do a drug swap one time to see if she's on any drugs. Yeah, she's not on any drugs. Just to make sure she's not getting a DUI on top of that. She's simply getting charged with the possession of a weapon. I would have let her off easy or not. Nah. Something suspicious about her. She might just got a fine vibe and a silence on her. Oh my god, glitch, glitch, glitch. Alright, let's just charge her for the silence. Even though it's technically not a weapon, we will still charge her for it. What the hell are you doing with the silence on your car unless you're gonna assassinate someone? That's the first time I've ever come across someone in GTA LSPFR with a silencer in their car. Like, for real? Seriously? Charges, possession. Firearm and weapons. Ah, uh, but I'm now. Yeah, they actually have a charge for that, so yeah. She's getting charged for an illegal device and device slash accessory for a firearm. That's the only charge she's getting. There's a misty minute, she probably will just get a few, um, a fine and a, or a few months in prison. That was really suspicious that I found the silencer. Interesting. So my screen is getting arrested. Got a uh, transport for. Assistance required in the Spooky Canal. He's coming over the hill there. Anyway, 
Dispatch request in tow truck. Yes, it's a rock where you're trying to go. Alright, that because I'm pounded. Something is right in here. Mm. Dispatch one link in eighteen, show me available. Alright guys, we're back on patrol. That stuff was really interesting, a bit suspicious. I knew something was wrong from the time she got nervous. I stopped her. And surprisingly we found a silencer in her car. And I see like the um I, I rather the built-in canine partner in um, ultimate backup to the actual mod. It's simpler than the actual mod actually. It's like a simple button to do everything instead of like the this guy is drunk. We already got a stop. What? What? Wow. He's probably gonna run. Can't you clearly see that I'm trying to pull over here? Let's go up a little bit more. We got to the side. Dispatch, show me on a stop. He's definitely drunk. I saw him swaying across the road. Like, seriously, dude. One shot of vodka an hour ago. Alright. You just confirmed that you were drinking. Never done drugs. So he's definitely drunk because he confirmed that he did one shot of vodka. That's the brutalizer test. Thank you. Okay. So the brutalizer test is coming back. Negative. No alcohol. That's interesting. But I know he's either drunk or high. He's, he's most likely high. We'll see. Gotta run him out of the vehicle. Some serenity test on him. Because he's def something is definitely wrong with him. It's the way he swerved. Oh, 
Oh, that's alright, it has the second server. He's... he passed that one. That one. I'd have to grab him to get him to the side for this one. This is definitely gonna walk into the road or something. So he looks like he's normal on walk on walking. Let's check his balance of one leg. Okay, so then something is either he passed that. Yeah, he's definitely not intoxicated. Surprisingly, surprisingly, he's not intoxicated. Just for necessary measures, let's check to see if he has any drugs in his system. Even though he denied that he never did drugs, let's just check for good measure. And he's clean. Alright. Why did he sweep? Okay, so he has a pulley sticker. Pulley stick. I said sticker. Wow, silly me. And uh, pepper spray is more but of clear liquid. That's kind of suspicious. Kind of, but it's not that suspicious. Since that is that suspicious, I'm just gonna detain him while I search his vehicle. Don't worry, you're just being detained. Are you kidding me? What the hell? Oh my lord, this thing is bugged out. Sorry Rex, I did some silly, silly stuff there. <laughs> yeah. So you confirm that he has nothing on him. I just fling the Rex out of the car. And now he's bugged out. Alright, I think we bugged out Rex. Okay, let's get another Rex. <laughs> oh lord. Alright, let's respawn Rex there. Uh, Has a misuse of the controller. I 
I'm going to stand up here before someone bounces down. Dog. Once the car is clean and he has nothing in the car, or the dog doesn't signal to anything in the car, I'll just release him and let him go. And the dog signals to something in the car. Well, boy. Let's see what's in the car. Holy shit, dude. What the hell? Wow, this episode is turned out to be very surprising. The guy has a friggin ID in his car. Oh my lord. Well. <laughs> Definitely got not gotten away with that one. He has an ID in his car. What the frick you do with an ID in your car, dude? Come on, man. You literally bouncing into my dog. Okay, so he's getting charged for the ID in his car. That's the only thing that he's getting charged for on right now. And reckless driving because he was slightly swerving all over the place when I pulled up behind him. Another drunk driver just passed me there. Blood the tub and give him his charges and this episode actually a bit shorter we did some traffic stops so why we charge him he got arrested before for armed the rub okay okay all right He got arrested twice for armed robbery and we found an ID in his car. What the f he's gonna get some serious time in jail. So two time he's gotten arrested. First two times was armed robbery. And now he has an ID in his car? Are you kidding me man? It's felony just enough explosive device and a reckless <laughs> just thinking about it he's got in charge for he has an ID in his car so he's got in charge for that right and reckless driving what the hell if the ID blew up in his car what the hell man Alright, so this charge is filed. There, there, filed. Let's get the prison transport for him. I'm going to check on the two charge, two um, court matters as soon as we're Assistance done with this. In wow, what an episode! Two traffic stops. Both of the two traffic stops turns out to be some very interesting stuff. One with an ID in his car and one with a silencer in a car. It's very interesting. This one has a history of having weapons, so... Uh, nothing new. Dispatch request in tow truck. Truck. 
required in Puerto del Sol. You know what I really rather now since I've been playing the SPFR, I rather use the um stop the pad backup and stuff and ultimate backup stuff. For some reason um RS managers RS manager glitches out with the suspects. For some reason. They like go into the car and then they just appear out of the car for some reason. Like totally bogged out. Uh, so I rather stop the pad. Uh, two truckers I was pick already picked up. It's the well. Another bug here. Okay, let's re let's turn around and see what's going on with that. Crazy drive here. Do not do this in real life. Let's make sure that everything's going good. That guy just ran into the back. Oh my lord. Wow. Oh freak, you guys have weight, what the hell is going on there? Oh, for well, I'll pretend like I did not see anything and return to station. Give me a pass there. Dispatch 1 Lincoln 18, show me return into station. Roger that. Uh, where's the nearest station? Nurse 1 would be this one. My bad there. Uh, uh, my bad again. Yeah. I wasn't gonna hit you. Alright guys, so thank you guys for tuning in to this episode of LSPDFR Patrol. You guys enjoying the series so far? Thank you all for all the support on the last episode of LSPDFR Patrol. Alright. As we return to the station. Let's see what charges, what um stuff we got on the two traffic stop that we did this episode bit of a different style of an episode usually there's a pursuit this episode but we're doing a bit of some K9 patrols so this episode is a bit different yeah I'm trying to park perfectly alright And guys, let's see what charges we got on those guys. So, yeah, all the rest of charges. The two was, um, where the second guy's name? Yeah, there's it. Okay, so the first person on the list for today's charges, uh, Miss Green, 
for a legal device slash accessories for firearm. She got sentenced to two years in prison. She actually got sentenced for whoa for the possession of an explosive device and a reckless drive and you got a fine of eight hundred and twenty two dollars license suspended for ten months and sentenced to four years in prison that was the last traffic stop that we did so guys that was it for this episode thank you guys for tuning in to this episode of SPFR Patrol the K9 Patrol today two traffic stops two arrests some interesting results when we search their vehicles one with an ID and one with a silencer anyway guys thank you for tuning in see you guys in the next one tomorrow drop a like hit that subscribe button don't forget to click on the bell icon see you guys in the next one Ashbos is out peace